Hello and welcome to Jam and Chat number 47. My name is Matthew and I'm your host. Today I have with you Jennifer Valiquette, the classical woodwind master. Thank you. Thank you, Matthew. <laughs> <laughs> no, I actually, I was really enjoying some of your classical pieces on YouTube the other day. Yeah, and, thank um, you. Well, one thing I wanted to talk about is um, improving our YouTube uh, analytics and I don't want to spend a long time on this but I found that the most two biggest important things to work with on YouTube um, we want to make videos that get our audience to stay the number one most important thing is audience retention audience retention rate the second most important thing is click-through rate click-through rate is your thumbnail right whether people are clicking on your video when YouTube shows it or not trying to get the highest audience retention rate possible and we're trying to get the highest click-through rate possible mm -hmm. so before the last week about the highest audience retention rate I was able to get was 50 percent and that was not my that was not uh, common most of my videos the audience retention rate was between say 25 and 40 percent that's a pretty big range most of it was in the 30 to 35 area right okay that's not good enough the YouTube algorithm is not going to be recommending me and you know letting the entire world see my videos if I'm only getting 35 percent on average working on that first because I think it's the one number one most important thing from the research I've done I wrote a new song for us to play and I actually am creating a new YouTube policy for myself and I'd like to share with everybody and I hope other people would um would, would go along with this policy and this policy is called stay to the end give a hundred percent audience attention rate to somebody when you click on their video stay to the end of the video I mean literally even if you turn the sound off on your phone and walk away because you know it's really super long I've had to do that for people all the time I've done that for ads for people because I want people to get paid right so the one time dude I swear I watched an hour-long ad for this chick who's a friend of mine I didn't actually watch it I just let my phone play it while I was on silent and then I came back an hour later and watched her video it was great so when wow. you watch when you watch somebody's video stay to the end you're really helping them a lot and we got a brand new song here that we're gonna play called stay to the end I wrote this song specifically for YouTube because you know how do I improve my audience retention rate? Well, I had an idea. Just ask directly. And so far, the video for this song, I'm getting in the 70s on the audience retention rate. That's my highest yet. It's another 20% higher than my highest before. Cool. So, yeah, that's pretty cool. All right. You ready? Ready. The only request that I have for you Stay to the end I could never abandon you, my friend My love I send You can make all my dreams come true Stay to the end as my heart pours out this song aloud, please stay to the end. Oftentimes you get distracted, I do too. Pause and come back when you like, I'm always here for you. Anytime you need, I will sing for you. The only request that I have for you, stay to the end. I could never abandon you, my friend, my love I send. You can make all my dreams come true stay to the end as my heart pours out this song aloud please stay to the end hang in there it's almost time to decide do we want to sing this song again The only request 
best that I have for you Stay to the end I could never abandon you, my friend My love I send You can make all my dreams come true Stay to the end As my heart pours out this song aloud Please stay the end the only request that I have for you stay to the end I could never abandon you my friend my love I send you can make all my dreams come true stay to the end as my heart pours out this song aloud Please stay to the end. Thanks, Matthew. Thank you so much. I liked it. So, did you notice all the negative harmony? Mm -hmm. I did. It's, negative harmony is so wonderful because it's allowing me to write a song in a major key and a minor key at the same fucking time. I know. I mean, it's in a major key. I mean, it's it's definitely G major. But mm -hmm. like, just oh man, all those That's beautiful cool. chords. I love them so much. I love it. Are you gonna put that one up on YouTube or did it's you? already up? Oh, it's already up. okay. It's, I've been a bit behind because I was away. So. It's okay. <laughs> it's okay. Check it out. And stay to the end when you do. Please, please. I will. I will. <laughs> <laughs> I had I had a catastrophe today. And it's an unspoken catastrophe. I never thought that this would happen. I never thought it would be a catastrophe. But I was looking through on my YouTube studio, and um, I found that there was like over a hundred comments that were being held for spam, and I just hadn't checked that. Wow. <laughs> so I was looking through my comments, and I the the mistake I made was. And a comment actually got deleted, and I was so wanted to put it on the screen for you guys, man. It was it was my first true hate. This person basically I don't remember who they were, and I don't remember <laughs> word for word what they said, but it was to my Moon Glow video where I was playing alto saxophone along with a background track, and I had enhanced the sound in my DAW, um, and the video probably wasn't perfect, but they said that I was a complete fraud. Don't subscribe to me. That I can't play it. All, and I'm, it's all canned music and I'm just uh, moving my fingers to fake it. That is ridiculous. <laughs> <laughs> I so oh want to God. show that to everybody. <laughs> I I the biggest like mistake I made was accidentally deleting it. <laughs> oh, that would have been so funny. Hate, 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 hate. I want to do that song next. <laughs> oh, yeah? I don't know if I can do it on saxophone. It's not really a saxophone song. No, no, you could just play the melody on the saxophone, yeah, I and I could, and I could, I could figure out an accompaniment for it. That'd be fun. <laughs> that would be fun. I'd have to listen to it though for the melody. But <laughs> thank you very much for joining me on Matthew's Music Lesson Studio. Please share this video, like, and subscribe to join my more than 500 subscribers. Thank you so much to each and every one of you, and please continue to tune in for all the great shows that I have to offer you. Thank you so much for joining me, and did you know that you can get online music lessons from me on Zoom? I record it MP4 for you, and you can then review that lesson forever. You can have it so we can go over it, you can practice along with it, and then that way, no matter what, you can relax and enjoy the lesson. So please, MatthewsMusicLessonStudio.com. I'll see you guys next time on Matthew's Music Lesson Studio.